Hello folks, Andy here. Welcome back on board Potemkin. Just arrived Saturday afternoon and this afternoon and tomorrow I'm going to get uh, the hatch extended at the back because I'm doing that engine bay out and the hatch don't go very far back so I'm going to take it off we're going to extend it and extend the rails it runs on so we've got a hatch that I can shove further back so you can stand up easy if somebody else comes up while somebody's on the tiller you can stand there and also make it easier to get in and out of it because it's a bit of a tight squeeze really so I think if I can make it a bit longer, it's only like a foot or so then uh, it'll make a lot better job of it but we've got a bit of prep work to do this afternoon I'm going to get all the paint cleaned off and the rotten paint on the roof and what have you so we'll go and have a look and we'll get on with that Right, we'll go and have a look at the top that roof's in a little bit of a mess <laughs> So that's the hatch, that paintwork needs a bit of a touch up, so we're going to get that cleaned off, so let's get on with it. Now nah, then Pete. Hey mate, how you been on? Oh, hey, I'm just doing a bit of work on here. About bloody time. <laughs> He's here, mad Pete. <laughs> I'm extending this, cutting my hatch further back. So we get a bit more room in there, right. that's all, because it's tight and if you're at home there and somebody's, it's nobody else can stand up here like, right. but it'd be easy to get in and out of it, so I'm going to extend it back here, extend this, so, oh, nice. shouldn't take much doing, no, bit, bit of a job, <laughs> yeah, ah, it is, <laughs> that's it, I've just made all that for a new boat, it's on it like, so, oh, just presses that on button with you, to finish off, forgot about that. <laughs> yeah. yeah, a bit of a vacuum in, now we'll get it stripped off. <laughs> right, that's the angle for the, to extend the sides of this. And that's the angle for the runners. So we'll get this off. Right, we've got this old chimney flange. Don't do well. We don't want it. That was the exhaust from the engine many years ago. So we've just got a couple of studs left. We're going to drill, cut them off and then I'll weld them up. Right, well we'll have the hatch off and get this cleaned off. This is the angle to extend this. clean all this off and it'll butt up to that, put some weld preps on it and weld it up but we can get it all cleaned off first. Okay, so that's cleared off now, enough for me to carry on and get it done, it wants more clearing off and then some vac tan on it, <laughs> looks a bit better than it did an hour ago. So next thing is we're going to get these angles on here and then get that lid altered. Right, so we've got these here, so that's the extensions. We can clamp this angle on, get it in line, and we can weld it up. That's it. Sat down right. So we'll get the welder. 
Right, that's it, let's get on. Right, they're tacked on, or stitched on. I'll just make sure it all works if I put the final full welds on. But there'll be a, when the cover's out, I can get to them anyway, so I'm not bothered. So we'll get that cover done next, and then we'll cut the roof out. Right, we're just going to alter that now. We're going to get that steel off at the back first. That's got that welded on the outside. I'll not get it all finished today, so I'll just make it so it works and goes back on. Plate on here. Stop water running in here. Get that on.
that's it, we're done for today. So thanks everyone for watching and liking and subscribing and I'll see you soon. Ta-ra!